Good morning, everyone. Uh, my professors, the doctors seated here, and I want to welcome everyone to the 12th International Multidisciplinary Co Conference on Current Research Trend, IMCCRT 2025. My name is Dr. Ricardo Luakemi Omolara, and I'm presenting on a topic integrating water, sanitation, and hygiene wash practice for improving health outcomes in semi-urban community, a case study of Ejebubo, southwestern Nigeria, and I'm presenting on behalf of my co-presenters. The presentation outlines include background to the studies, statement of the problem, aim and objective of the study, statement of the problem, description of the study area, materials and method, results and discussion conclusion, recommendation, and um, the references. Access to clean water sanitation is a very paramount in sustaining human health. Water is life. Without water, nobody can live. We use water for various purposes, for domestic activities, agricultural activities, industrial activities, public health issues, environmental issues. All lives, both plants and animals, depend on water for their development and growth, according to World Health Organization 2020. And even Uni um, United Nations Sustainability Development Goals, um, according to Goal C, states emphasize the importance of ensuring universal access to water. And despite the global effort, water is still passing or is still undergoing threat from both natural and anthropogenic activities. And the Jebubo as a study area is not left out. Being a semi-urban area, a community where people reside doing their domestic and um, industrial activities. And yet their water condition is prone to contamination due to the environmental issues prevailing within the study area. However, implementing interventions in this kind of locality like Ijebubo is needed in order to understand the existing barriers, community dynamics and um, resources constraint within the study area. So this study aims to assess current state of wash, that is water, sanitation and hygiene infrastructure and practices in Ijebubo to evaluate their impacts on public health. The objective includes to assess the current state of the water, sanitation and hygiene infrastructure in Jebubo to identify key barriers to effective wash implementation, to propose sustainable strategy for improving wash practices in, in Jebubo, the study area, then to evaluate the role of community engagement and governmental government policies in enhancing wash outcome. So the statement of the problem, because if there are no problem, then there's no need for research. Why we visited um, Ijebubo, we, because we had a case of um, cholera outbreak in Ijebubo, so we visited the area um, to observe, we carry our reconnaissance survey before this detailed survey. Then we back up our research with um, secondary data obtained from hospitals nearby, the, um, around the study, within the study area. So Jebubo faced significant water challenges including limited portable water, insufficient sanitation facilities and poor hygiene practices. The Jebubo is located in Nogun State, southwestern Nigeria is a semi-urban community with a population of approximately 150,000 um, people being characterized by mixed social activities including farming and um, trading. The material ad adopted for this is qualitative and both um, qualitative quantitative research which involves surveys on um, focal group discussion that is discussion with the community heads we create a participatory discussion with the women the men the market women the women leader the youth leaders to really understand the watch situation 